So, today we're going to be talking about STR Devilman. Now, I think I did a video on AGL Devilman, the little SR from the World Tournament uh, Summon Banner. I think I did a video on him. I remember doing a video talking about why Devilman is banned from, I think it was most events. I think it's almost all events. I, I, weird, I weirdly worded it uh, just like in the title. So, whatever okay so devil man let's see what we got here so this guy comes out uh, august 6th of 2024 on jp so he's a fairly recent card he literally comes out last month just about this card's almost what two months old just about almost two months old uh so devil man what do we have here of course uh, this card coming out in uh, today's meta um this guy's just a fun little nifty card you could use and one thing about this card that i was very surprised to find out is that this card has no 200 percent leader skills wow and he has a very bad link set his best linking partner would easily have to be lr jackie chun is like come on now what is that is that king choppa i think that's king choppa i haven't watched og dragon ball in years i think that's king choppa i think i might have said his name wrong um, but yeah, it's pretty much Jackie Chun's, which is the best thing partner. And you're absolutely going to run LR Jackie Chun right, right next to him. Uh, because, I mean, 7 key, 32% attack, 22% defense, and a 7% chance of crit. More so, the defense is more important because of the fact that he is a free-to-play TUR. But, uh, yeah, let me just see. He supports World Tournament, right? He does. Yeah, all he does is support World Tournament. 3 key and 50% attack and defense. That's monstrous support for LR Jackie Chun. Remember when this guy first came out, he's pretty, pretty damn good. I mean, Jackie Chun. Wasn't this guy tanking Broly around the time of his release? Uh, Red Zone Broly. <laughs> that, that shit, that was crazy. That 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 was crazy. Okay, so uh, Devil Man. Um, so it's yeah. He wait, he is. Whoa! So he is getting the support from. He is. Three key and fifty percent of the stats. Yeah. So LR Jackie Chun is giving him three key and 50% attack and defense. That's very that's very helpful with this card, for sure. Um, anyways, uh, let's talk about Devilman, of course, um, in this meta. Are you really gonna be using Devilman? No, considering the fact that he isn't on any 200 percent leader skills. He's just pretty much like a fun little nifty card you could just run. That's pretty much that. I think he's a pretty interesting card, considering the fact that his uh his counterpart, that being the AGL SR from like like 50 years ago is uh, doing a, a bajillion damage because he has that very very ultra low chance of like uh getting what's that i think it's a one million percent attack that's from the sr <laughs> listen that's from the sr anyways so uh let's see devil man of course he's a uh, stream sdr his leader skill is tournament participants three key and 50 percent two stats and his 12 key that being the demon for crush he gets 30 percent defense for four turns which is obviously very good for a card of this caliber that's good um and his passive uh devil's trump card he gets two key and 200 percent defense just baseline and he gets 200 percent attack starting from the fourth turn from the character's entry turn and he also gets 50 percent defense when attacking and within the same turn he gets a 50 percent chance to dodge and he gets an additional 200 percent attack defense and launches an additional attack that has a 50 percent chance of a super attack when there are four or more dragon ball saga characters on the team so you want to run those dragon ball saga characters so he gets that additional 200 percent attack defense as well as that additional super attack chance and he also has a 70 percent chance to crit when attacking extreme class allies well not allies excuse me enemies oh my god leave that in the video we're not cutting that out extreme class enemies <laughs> let's continue starting from the sixth turn <laughs> starting from the sixth turn from the start of battle and he has a 50% chance of getting 66% attack when attacking. And if HP is 66% or more when attacking, he has a very rare chance of getting 666% attack. Okay, getting an additional 666% attack. And that is a what? That's a 5% chance to crit. Oh, one second, guys. My phone just went off. I'm leaving that in the video, too. Okay. Um, so what do we have with this guy, right? So, uh, I mean, he does have a bunch of, he has a lot of high stats, but that does, what, does that make sense? It does make sense considering the fact that, I mean, Devilman, um, I guess because his counterpart, that SR, he does get that, that crazy monstrous 1 million percent attack. That's a, it's like an ultra rare chance. I think that's like a 1% chance. Yeah. 
and these of course are stats it does make sense because in the fact that it's devil man um so what do we have here uh he gets up to a uh what's that 50 percent chance to dodge right over here i mean a 50 percent chance to dodge is the only defensive maneuver he has to fall back on he does get that 70 percent chance to crit when attacking a extreme class enemy makes sense because i'm pretty sure the little the little gag with devil man in the show is uh the little the beam that he does doesn't that like i don't know doesn't it like instantly kill something i don't remember the little gag with devil man but it's something to do with having something bad in your heart and doesn't devil man in the show use it against goku and it doesn't work i think it's something about like something with goku having a pure heart i don't remember someone down below please explain it for me because i don't exactly remember i'm gonna read it and of course i'm gonna like it I haven't read comments in the past couple of days because i have been pretty busy but i'm gonna read them today so um he gets up to a 70 percent chance to crit as well as a 50 percent chance to dodge he has 200 percent defense at the start of the turn 200 percent attack from the fourth turn from this character's entry he gets 50 percent defense as well as if it's of course 50 percent chance to dodge he gets additional 200 percent attack and defense as well as additional super attack chance we have four or more dv side category allies on the team which you really want to have so you can get that additional attack defense above as well as that additional super attack chance as well as him from the start from the fifth the sixth turn he does get that, that uh, additional 50 percent chance to get 66 percent attack as well as him having that what's that 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 five percent chance to get 666 percent attack um you get that and he's gonna hit pretty hard no brainer um you don't and it's gonna be pretty much just this and his active skill that being the devil might beam he gets 50 percent attack temporarily and causes ultimate damage to an enemy ultimate damage okay for this guy all right and can be activated when hp 66 percent or more starting from the sixth turn from start of battle so i mean six 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 i mean devil man makes sense he has a whole lot of sixes because of course de devil man and his link set uh demonic power world tournament champion fortune teller baba's fighter which he actually of course is fortune teller baba's fighter what does this link give three key and five percent attack and defense i mean but holy hell these are actually fortune teller baba's fighters too like from the show uh but yeah who are they missing are these all the fighters isn't Am I crazy or isn't Grandpa Gohan? Wasn't Grandpa Gohan one of the fortune teller Baba's fighters? Am I I yo, I, I gotta be crazy. I gotta go back and watch OG Dragon Ball again. I'm I'm very certain. Didn't she have five fighters? It was Devil Man, Invisible Man, uh Bandages, right? That's his name, Bandages. And what was his name again? Fangs? His name was Fangs in the show. I know I know it was Fangs in the show. He accepts one, two, three, four. And I swear it was Fortune Teller Baba's last fight. It was Grandpa Gohan. It had to be. I don't, bro. Why is OG Dragon Ball just like so spotty in my memory right now? I watched the whole thing over about like, I don't remember, like years ago. Okay. Um, yeah. Terrible Link set. Terrible, terrible Link set. Fortune Teller Baba's fighter. The Incredible Adventure. I mean, of course, that that's probably one of his best. I think it's um, God is a Dragon Ball. I mean, cool. Shot in the limit. Yeah, he has a terrible link set and a severe lack of categories. And his, uh, I don't know. Yeah, this guy's just a, a little nifty. Just a nifty fun card to run. That's it. Good super attack effect. I mean, he does have a defensive ability to fall back on. But if he doesn't dodge, he gets completely blown up. Are you running Messiah Meta content? Hell no. Um, that's about it for this guy. Yeah, just a fun little free-to-play unit to run. Because this guy's not going to realistically hold up. And DB Saga. Who are the best DB Saga cards? Real quick, just take a quick check. Um, of course, Roshi. Um, Bulma. Uh, Patku. Could you still get some users out of him? Um, Aider, if he's ran with Patku. Um, uh, hmm. Could this team use a little bit more buffs? I mean, you could run Bulma, absolutely. It's like Bulma, Double Confess Roshi, um, Bulma again. <laughs> I mean, that's technically Bunny Bulma. Um, yeah, his team could use a bit more. I mean, you do have this NTN. This guy is low-key. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much the whole gist with uh, Devil Man. Just a little fun card to run. There's not much more to say. Uh, and he has no 200% of his skills. His best linker partner is, uh, is LR Jackie June. And, um, ladies and gentlemen, let's redirect our attention over to the GOAT Dokkan Worlds video. Because I'm using him as a reference for most of the videos going forward. So, huge shout out to him. Okay. So he uses a, the Devil Might Beam on Frieza, and he gets Frieza gets packed up. He has an evil heart. Yes. Let's see turn one. Um, without his best linking partner, um, there's a lot of support in this rotation. Doesn't Bunny Bulma support? I don't remember. I don't remember if she supports or not. I didn't even pull her. I think did I pull Bunny Bulma? 
I did I summon on Roshi? I don't even think I summoned on Roshi because I was saving. He starts out with 185k defense. Not really all that great. But yeah, let's see what he does. And this is the legendary Frieza event, right? Okay. So 1.7 million. Not great. No, it's it's fair to say the fact that it's his first super. He does another one. 1.8 million. Wow. Devilman. Calm down. Yeah, he has that crit chance because of uh, Frieza. And the bomb will open up with 10 million. Um, let's skip straight to Nuking turn. Okay. He's right next to his best linker partner, LRB Pants. Active skill up. He's on... Uh, there's no 200% skill active. Let's see what we got here. And we hit Rose in the face with... Okay, no. Never mind. Give it one second. Hope you guys are doing good, by the way. Um, on this fine Friday. Uh, Cheetos? Um, Doritos? Um, we snacking while we watching? No? We playing Dogon? Um, and he gets hit with 26 million. Crit. And then 38.4 million. And let's see the damage. Nice. And Goku Black got cooked. So that's about it. I'm going to leave uh, Dokkan World's video as a source down below in the description below. Um, Devil Man. Um, summon him up. Um, he's just a fun card to run. Just a little fun card. No 200% of these skills. Terrible link set. Severe lack of categories. He needs a 200% of these skill. Badly Dokkan. Um, he, the best things about him is that he has a 50% chance to dodge. He has a, I mean... A, a bunch of stats. I mean, 200% attack right over here. Granted, of course, it's restricted from the fourth turn onward. He gets 200% defense right over here at the start of the turn. 200% attack defense right over here, as well as additional super attack chance, a 50% chance to dodge, a 70% chance to crit. He is pretty restricted by him having specific enemies. Specific enemies, bro. Now I'm flipping the things. We're leaving it there. He's pretty restricted with him having to be fourth turn from, from the character's entry turn. Him also having to have four or more DB Saga characters. Him having to go up against a extreme class enemy. Him having to be six turn onward. Him being locked behind chances for his additional high amounts of attack. Yeah, it's just a lot of, uh, he's just locked behind a bunch of things. Pretty much. But does it make sense because the Devil Man? Hey, it's pretty much that's what it is. And of course, his active skill in the six turn, sorry, battle. There's that. But yeah, I appreciate you guys for watching. You guys are the best. I'll catch you guys next time. I absolutely love you all. I'm not editing out none of that, those mess-ups I made in this video. I'm not. We're leaving that exactly as is. Peace.